Hello everybody. I hope everybody's having a great day today. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. And for all those who don't know who I am yet, my name is Bridget. I am a middle-aged woman who has worn makeup for my entire adult life. I started about 19, but didn't know what the bleep I was doing, even though I thought I did. <laughs> and now... <laughs> I am trying to essentially make up for lost years and uh, hence the YouTubes. <laughs> Why not? Let's show the world how I can't draw. <laughs> I'm having fun. I'm allowed to have fun in my middle age. Okay, so today is essentially part two of what I was doing yesterday and hopefully you'll get it that way as well. I have no idea. I never know how people get things or how I do things because I have medical reasons I have to, yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. Um, yesterday was creams and today it is liquids and I've got what seems to be cream slash liquids in here as well we're just gonna it, it, it doesn't matter it's eyeshadow that's what matters and it's beautiful eyeshadow so we're going to do it that way um, I have a little pot of mattes and the rest is pretty much all shimmers and uh, I'm wearing some today. I had to. I had to. Look at that. What am I wearing today? Moira Cosmetics. I am... Oh. <sighs> Moira, can you send me some PR, please? <laughs> I am shameless. I will ask for it. <laughs> I don't demand. I just ask. Please. But yeah, it's essentially what I'm wearing on my lids today. And I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. We shall swatch everything. Let us start. Um, I don't even know where to start because it's all gorgeous. Let's start with my Sephora. I've got one Sephora. And it's a green. And this is a color I should be wearing more. And for some reason, I don't know why I don't. I really... Actually, that's not quite true. I think I do know. I've been thinking about this. And I think the reason I don't wear it... Isn't that beautiful? It's a nice hunter green. I wore green for a couple of years um, in high school as part of my uniform. And I had no problems with green there. Because I even continued wearing green for many years after that. So that's not... I wasn't traumatized there. <laughs> um, but I think the green that I don't wear has to do with my eyes. And I think it has to do with mommy issues. <laughs> I'm not kidding, <laughs> unfortunately. My mother used to wear green eyeshadow every now and then. When she would wear makeup... It was usually green eyeshadow. And I think that's what's done it subconsciously. It took me a few years to come up with that. But this has green sparkle in it and I'm wearing it. So I'm making progress. <laughs> Is it the one I'm wearing today? No, it's not. I don't know anymore. I'm telling you, I have memory issues. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Okay. And then I've got one House Laboratories. I got this one off BoxyCharm. Not in a box, but it was part of a sale. And the funny thing is, this is the second time I put this on my hand today because I was trying to figure out what to wear on my eyes earlier. And this was one of the options. So the reason I'm doing this is... 
I don't know what the reason I'm doing this for. I managed to get rid of a few cream shadows yesterday. I put three in the bin for the girls and I put two in the garbage because they had to go. Um, so it's not necessarily for a declutter because yes I have a lot but I don't have that much at the same time. I have more than the average user and I have a hell of a lot more than I used to have. Good grief. I used to have one quad. I think I had maybe two lipsticks that I never wore. I had a mascara. I had one foundation. I had the bare minimum. This is Kosas that I got through BoxyCharm as well and it is Copper Halo and yes we have to remember that this is very liquidy and not to turn anything over. I got lucky I figured that out before I turned it over <laughs> I because as you can tell it's it's still pretty high up there. I have seen so many people and it's down here because <laughs> it's whoops. So there is Copper Halo and it is beautiful. I have yet to wear it and I've had it for a while and that's a shame. I'm bad that way because I've got so many beautiful eyeshadows, palettes. <laughs> I've got my 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 Yeah, this this is my shop, my stash, and and my um, what's the other one called? Bad memory. It's it's all in there. Shop my stash and and stuff I'm trying to use up. It's all in there, and that's what I use daily, unless I feel like. Today, I have to use something else. I had to. <laughs> I had to use the liquids because I knew I was doing a video about the liquids. And this is a mini Lorac. I'm going to show you all three of them together. Oh. They really are pretty. Oh, this one's a topper. There we go. Isn't that fun? You guys sitting there watching and waiting. When is she going to be done doing this? Come on, hurry up, lady. <laughs> okay, so what do I have here? I have right there um, Tankinis Solstice and Seashell Seashell there that's better that's what I've got these are beautiful and I'm glad they're minis because these things don't last forever so that's pretty cool okay now I'm going to do these. I need to wear these. I really do. I don't know why I don't. Yeah, I do. It's because I end up wearing my powders. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> these are, do I have room? Yeah, we can do it there. These are the balm. And they're doe foot are very very I'm gonna have to do this this way their doe foots are very very like that <sighs> their doe foot supplier needs to be changed That's all I got to say about that. I need to get another method because this the second one that's 
popped. Let's see. Is this one going to stay on? Because I'm barely pressing. Ooh, it stayed on. <laughs> That's a miracle. So that means this one is off. <laughs> yep. Yeah. So let's see if I can do this. I mean, it's a beautiful color. It is a beautiful color. Okay. Only two hands. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's do this. So, I don't need this anymore. We've got a mystery Irish coffee. It's beautiful absolutely gorgeous and then we've got rosé that's so pretty and then we've got i'm hoping the camera will focus lavender mimosa look at that the this is these two are definitely summer colors i i have to wear them this summer i really do and I have to find myself, like, this is not too bad, it's just it's too fat. So I just got to go to the dollar store and figure it out. Because dollar stores are great for stuff like this. This one will not fit because it's, if this is too fat, that's just beyond. So what's next? All right, this is In Pursuit. We've got one. I love the Moira shadows. I really do. This is eye contact. I usually use this as a topper. And then we've got Gold Star. I found out about Moira Cosmetics because of Rose and Ben. Rose recommended them. I fell in love with them. Between Rose and... <sighs> Memory. Another lady, absolutely amazing. Between those two ladies, I'm broke. <laughs> And I don't have much money to buy stuff to begin with. <laughs> it's just, it's, yeah. Okay, now I'm going to do these three. We're going to go to mattes before I finish off the pack. I have Rimmel, and I need to get at least one more of these. This is the Wundercloud All Day Wear Soft Shadow. I can't get my hands on the matte shadows from um, that store in the U.S. that isn't here, Ulta. <sighs> Which are apparently amazing. I, I gotta, I, I, I have to do this. Where's my YouTube? Where's my YouTubes? This is insane, Bridget. There's the YouTubes. Okay. First off, she just... Yeah, Amanda Zed. Amanda Zed. She swears by the Ulta Liquid Matte Shadows. I, 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 I would love to get my hands on them, but they don't ship to Canada. And I'm not paying, even though the, the prices might not be that much, but I'm not paying for the shipping to come up here through a third party. I just, I can't. 
and broke. <laughs> it's that simple. So when I saw this at the drugstore, I grabbed one. I wanted to grab them all, <laughs> but it, no, I had to grab only one. So the color I grabbed is Truffle Haze. It is beautiful and it blends so well. I don't know if it can be compared to the, uh, what's it called, the um, Ulta brand, but I wish Amanda Zed would go see if she can get her hands on this and be able to compare them. Uh, the other two mattes that I have, I got from the cosmetics company store. They are the Melted Chocolate Matte Eyeshadows from Too Faced. I don't think I've ever seen anybody talk about these online. They are exceptionally pigmented. And for somebody who's not very good, difficult to work with, but I managed somehow at one point, but they are so beautiful. So as far as I'm concerned, very worth it. This color is a warm and fudgy right there. Look at how pigmented and dense the color is. I mean, it's, it's brilliant. It's absolutely brilliant. This one is called Chocolate Wine. I only got two because money. <laughs> but look at that. You can wear purples, you can wear pinks. It doesn't matter. And, and the warm and fudgy, you can wear any other color. So it's absolutely brilliant. And those are my mattes. And I love liquid mattes. I really do. Okay, so next we are dealing with my last five. The first two technically should have gone yesterday on yesterday's video because they are the Dazzle Sticks from KVD Beauty. This is the first thing I caved and decided to buy from KVD Beauty. And this, of course, was only after Kat Von D was no longer involved with the company. Now, I used to watch her show all the time. I loved her. She is beautiful. She is talented. She did, so smart. Like, I mean, seriously, she made a, an, an amazing business for herself. And the artistry she has, oh my God, and she's so gorgeous. She would make me turn gay, okay? <laughs> I, I, I may be being a little facetious, but a little bit. And I can say that because one of my girls is gay. <laughs> Megan, you know. <laughs> um, but the fact that she is such an outspoken anti-vaxxer I can't I can't I've got I've got kids you know especially at that point my, my my kids were little my kids are up and out and having kids of their own now um, but I've been vaccinated and I got the chicken pox when my number two daughter got the chicken pox oh my god I think she was two and that's when I got the chicken pox. I was 36, 35. Yeah. Vaccinate your kids, people. <laughs> it's all I got to say. So because of that anti-vax association, I just couldn't. I couldn't. That, that's just too important to me. Too many kids die because of lack of vaccination. 
and kids are everything. Kids are the future. So that's what that entire rant was all about. But now she's no longer involved. But I'm pretty sure they're still using her chemists. And whoever came up with these formulations is beyond brilliant. I, they better be throwing money at these chemists, you know, because they are brilliant. This is, what color is this? This, this is nails, Hail Surge. Come on, come on, come on, cooperate. That's Hail Surge. And this is Force Field. I've only got two. I gotta put it here. I think there's six. But look at, come on camera. You need to show what this looks like. Like seriously, these, these are like beyond. I should have worn these today. <laughs> They are magic, as far as I'm concerned. They are magic. And I got them through BoxyCharm. <laughs> okay, now the last three, and I've run out of space on this arm. These last three, I wish I had two, maybe three more. I would be happy with that. These are the Donessa Merix Color Fix. I have two colors and a glaze and I need to use the glaze. I mean, I'm going to use the glaze tomorrow because and hopefully I'll remember to tell you why as I babble on about this. These, even I have no trouble using them. Like, I mean, seriously, if I had to choose between the Dazzle Sticks and, and Danessa Merrick's um, Color Fix, I think I would stick to the Color Fix. As much as I love the Dazzle Sticks, if I could only choose one, it would be the Color Fix. First of all, because there's a whole lot bigger range. Second off... I think the storage of them is better. And they've also got mats. <laughs> so, which one did I give you? This is Ballerina and this is Gold Mine. So you've got Ballerina and Gold Mine. Are we getting the camera dangle showing better? There we go. Now, there's a glaze. I've used a glaze. As far as I'm concerned, the glaze is better on a mat. But that's my opinion. Now, I'm going to put it on half. I'm going to put it on half. <laughs> I didn't realize I was babbling that long. <laughs> oh, maybe I should have put it on the other half. <laughs> but, like, I mean, these are shiny to begin with, but when you put the shine of this on top of it, it is, it is beyond, like, let's try this. Okay. We are not at the right angles here. I hope you guys can see that. I really do, because I see a difference. And I see that it's just amazing. I put it on the three mats. 
Come on. I'm trying to reposition some lights here. <laughs> Let's see if my light is to max. Nope. Yeah, there we go. It was. But look at that shine. Look at that shine. As far as I'm concerned, everybody should be going out to get this. I've never seen anybody use it. I don't know why. It's at... I did a shop my stash a couple days ago and then I started using singles. <laughs> just dumped all my singles into my 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 bucket it's hilarious I'm gonna have fun washing yesterday after I did my video yesterday oh man it was hilarious um I couldn't get half of it off <laughs> oh my god I was scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing and then okay get some more and scrubbing and scrubbing I can't give up. <laughs> oh, criminy. Okay, so there you go. This is, as you can hear it, and it's probably annoying you, me putting everything back in the tray because i got to get ready for a thumbnail. <laughs> but... Uh, Favorite number one is Moira. Number two is Danessa Merrick. And number three has got to be the mattes. I love the Too Faced mattes because they have a little bit more range and color even though they don't have that many. But I prefer the formula of the Rimmel and their range of color is pathetic <laughs> to say the least <laughs> but I, I need to buy one more so hopefully next month so I don't know why I'm not getting rid of anything I don't know I don't know you know what I'm going to give my Girls, the Lorac ones. That's what I'm going to do. I want to keep the lilac because it's absolutely gorgeous and I need to use it in the summertime. And I'm going to keep the, 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 what's it called, Irish coffee, and give away the rosé. I think it's the only one with the doe foot. Because <laughs> I love this color. Yeah, I think that's what, like, can you imagine these two together and just put a little bit of this in the middle. I guess I know what I'm doing tomorrow. <laughs> oh, criminy. Yeah, I'm keeping the rest. I am uh, definitely keeping the rest. There are two that are not in here because they are liners. <laughs> and they are from uh, Berry M Cosmetics. And I don't think I'm going to keep them because... One is silver and the other one is blue. Yeah, I think those are going to go. They came in a pack of what I bought from Barry M Cosmetics. Uh, so yeah, I think I'm going to declutter those. Good grief, these videos were not meant to be declutters. How's that happening? <laughs> Thank you everybody for coming to visit with me once again and spending all this time with me. Please 
leave me a comment, like my video, subscribe to my channel. A bientôt!